Hi guys, Matt Thomas here at Cedar Rock Studio Guitar Gallery in Indiana. And today we've got another very lovely Caton guitar. Now this one is actually his Sullivan. So that's a little different than the last Carolina model. Um, and this is, this is a cool little guitar. Uh, well, I don't want to say little because it, it's, it's a, a fairly decent sized guitar. Um, now this one actually features a really beautiful Engelman top with just a touch of bear claw throughout it. But look at this gorgeous Picote. Uh, it's in the same kind of family as Zircote. And it's just got a little more of a, a light brown hue to it. But it tends to get all those beautiful swirls and kind of bird's eye looking things throughout it. And I love that it's that he went ahead and matchbooked it through the sapwood there. Um, <clears throat> now these do feature his signature kind of sound port, which is supposed to both give you the volume of the instrument, but also help you really feel it in the chest. Uh, and it doesn't take a lot of mass out of the side, so it doesn't really stop a whole lot of the energy transfer to the, the back. Now, it's got what I assume is a Buckeye Burl rosette here. But you can tell this is an ebony bridge, but it, it looks crooked, obviously, because it's a multi-scale. So we've got 2525 on the treble to 25 and three quarter, or 25.75 on the bass. So it, it really holds up to like lowered C tunings. Now, it's got an ebony fretboard with nothing on the face of it other than this real thin um, maple purfling that kind of makes that box and, and shapes the fretboard itself. But it does have some mother of pearl side dots that help you find your way all the way up to the 19th fret there. Now, it's got an ebony head cap, but look at this gorgeous Bacote back cap, which I think just looks so cool when you flip the instrument around to show people. Um, now, one more thing, it's got the Delta Series Gotos on them. So there are 21 to one ratio, which really helps. Like that, when you really need to dial in lower tunings, that little extra bit of ratio helps a lot. But enough about the features of it. This thing sounds phenomenal. Very big and bold. It's nice to have that kind of little bit of shorter scale on these trebles because it makes them just a touch sweeter sounding, but there's, there's a lot of sensitivity to this instrument. You can get vibrato out of these top trebles. Um, and it's got great harmonics on it. This is one of the few Bacote guitars that I've played and it does kind of remind me a little bit of Zero Cody and it's immediacy, but also it's ability to sound nice and deep and bassy. So now if you've got any other further questions about this 2019 Sullivan model, Kate and guitar, message Alan at cedarrockstudio.com and thanks for listening. Thank you.